Hey there Sky Kids, welcome back to another tutorial. Today I'll teach you the Chibi Forward PC, a super fun trick that makes your Sky Kid look like the diamond face for its into adventure. But more importantly, it can help you discover out of bounds areas and speed up your candle rise. I mean, who would want to grab those waxy goodies faster, right? Now, I've done a Chibi Forward tutorial before, but I noticed some of you were still confused, that's why this time, I'm explaining everything step by step while talking and showing the controls on screen. So are you ready to master it? Alright, let's get into it! So what is the chibi for? It's a neat little animation glitch where your sky kid gets so tired of walking, they decide to just face plant into the ground and fall out of bounds. Okay, not really tired, but this glitch lets you sneak into areas faster, making it perfect for quicker candle runs, or just exploring the skies in your chibi form. It's also hilariously adorable, like a tiny sky kit tantrum. I mean, don't we all wish we could just fall through the floor when life gets tough? Before we dive into the steps, let's talk about a recent update in Sky. The fly toggle button, which used to be the right mouse button, is now mapped to tab by default. While this might work for some players, it can make tricks like the Chibi before much harder to perform. And to make things easier, I recommend heading into the control settings and reassigning the fly toggle back to right mouse button. This adjustment will help you pull off this trick smoothly and keep things feeling familiar. First things first, your Skyken needs the right setup. First, equip the chibi mask from your wardrobe to shrink your character into adorable proportions. Second, use the sneaky stance from the stealthy survival spirit in Wasteland. This stance is key to the trick. Think of it as your sky kid going into stop mode. Ready for mischief? If anyone asks where you're sneaking, just say you're on a secret candle heist. Next, find a good soap. This trick works best on sleeping clients. You can experiment in areas like Isle of Dawn or Daylight Priory to see which spot works best. Think of it as slope shopping. Find one that screams, fall here! Now for the magic. First you need to stand while facing the slope. And then, hold the right mouse button to activate your sneaky stance. If you see a circle underneath your sky kit, that means it's working. While holding the right mouse button, use the WASD keys to move your sky kit into position. Now, these keys will depend on what kind of perspective you are in. If your perspective is like this, then you have to click the W button. Also, make sure their legs start to clip into the slope and adjust until their face is practically buried in it. Um, um, your sky kid might look like they're sniffing the grounds for tuffles though, but hey, it's part of the process. And finally, release all the keys that you're holding at the same time. If you've done it right, your sky kid will dramatically fall out of bounds. And then, ta-da! Chibi fall achieved! Also, I thought you might need to know about this firework stuff trick for Chibi Fall. 
The fabric stuff makes Chibifo much easier even on slopes. You still need a slope, but the best part is your Skyke doesn't need to bury their face into it anymore. Just hold the firework stuff while performing the chibi fall in the right way and follow the usual steps, okay? And then stop moving at the right moment, release the keys, and then the magic happens. Bonus tips If you don't fall, double check your positioning. The Skykit's legs need to clip into the slope for this to work. Like this. Also, practice makes perfect. You'll get the hang of it after a few tries. It took me a lot of practice before I mastered this trick on PC, so don't worry. And if anyone catches you falling over and over, just tell them your Skykit is a drama queen. And there you have it, the Chibu Fall on PC. Whether you're speeding up your candor runs or just showing off your Skygate's acrobatics, this trick is as fun as it is useful. If you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more Sky Shenanigans. Now go out there and fall like a pro, literally. See you in the skies, fellow face planters.